Hello, hello, beautiful rising. Good afternoon and or lovely evening to all you beautiful people. Thank you for stopping by my channel again today. If spirit has led you here or if someone has shared this message for you, with you, then um, it's your lucky day because there's something in this message today for you. We will be doing our daily chakra card reading. I will be pulling one card to see where our focus, what chakra we should be focusing on for the day. Um, and then at the end of each week, I will be reviewing the cards that we got during the week and see where there's a theme or if there's a theme so that it can help us to continue to grow and be our best selves. So I thank you again for coming on this journey with me. Let's get started. So if you watch the video from yesterday, January 1st, then you will see that um, our the card that we pulled was for the root chakra yoga poses. So what I got from that was spirit telling us first of all to move our bodies but also to work on our foundation. So um, you know work on things that we need to be feel secure about. So it could be you know home, financial, relationships, whatever it is. Um, but yeah, that was our card for yesterday was the yoga poses for the root chakra. And oh look, I just split and there's a root chakra. <laughs> so let's see what, what card spirit wants us to pull today. So we're going to give this a few more shuffles. And pull our card. So I hope that everyone is enjoying their new year and whatever resolutions you have made. I hope that you are able to keep them. So this, these chakra card readings are one of my new year's resolutions. So I am also hoping to keep it as well. So, but I figure doing it this way will be easier to keep it. So here we go. Let's spread the cards out and you know what? This one right here. Oh, yeah, this one, the sacral chakra. All right, so that's the second chakra. So the second day and the second chakra is coming up. Um, and before I started this video, I was feeling like pressure in my sacral chakra. And I was just thinking, I said, oh my gosh, if the sacral chakra comes up for the second day, then that's going to be amazing. So we did get balancing the sacral chakra. Um, imbalances in this chakra can lead to bladder and kidney problems, circulation program, problems, and migraines. Excessive energy in this chakra can lead to aggress aggression. Manipulative and overindulgent tendencies a, defici a deficiency of energy in this chakra can lead to guilt, distrust, and resentment. There are many ways to bring balance to this chakra. See these in the following cards. So, perhaps um, there is some imbalances within our sacral chakra that we all need to address. So, the imbalances can lead to bladder or kidney problems. So if any of you are having any bladder or kidney problems, circulation problems, migraines, um, if you are aggressive or manipulative and over overindulgent, you know, perhaps you have too much energy in your sacral chakra, but 
The sacral chakra is orange, and this is the number five, and the fives represent change. So, um, definitely with balancing our sacral chakra, we will, I mean, it will help lead us to positive changes. So, that is the card that we are, that we chose today. I thank you again for tuning in today and being part of this sacral or chakra energy chakra energy reading and I hope that you all have a beautiful day. So pay attention to your sacral chakra. It is, you know, right below your belly button. So if you have any pains that seem to be like around your bladder or anything like to that effect, then I mean, either pay attention to your sacral chakra, see if you feel like you are in, have an imbalance, or I mean, if you think it's anything more serious, of course, go and see a doctor. But um, for the most part, we are speaking of the chakra energy and um, there are many ways to help to balance the sacral chakra. So I thank you once again for tuning in today. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe to the channel if you like these videos. And I will see you in the next one. Have a great day. Bye.